Hi everyone, I'm Jane Hunt. It's a real honor to be asked to judge the Boulder Art Association show. It's a beautiful show and I've lived here in Boulder for over 25 years, so it's particularly special to me. And uh, this sheep painting, I, it was for fun and it was really interesting to see all the different takes on this. So um, the first award I gave was this little piece right here. That's J.T. Fisher, and congratulations, that's the On the Lamb Award. And I thought this was just incredibly creative, beautiful use of, of textures and colors, and just a really fun piece. And the second award, the Best in Sheep, oops, Best in Sheep Award, goes to Jay Sharp. Some technical difficulties here, but <laughs> hopefully you can see this is absolutely beautifully drawn, really skillfully done, and it really puts the, the sheep center stage, but it's also well composed. So congratulations, and I'll turn you around in case you haven't seen the show yet. It's absolutely beautiful, a lovely space. Congratulations to everyone who's in it. I'm going to walk you around so you can see it. And let's see. First of all, the Rising Star Award that goes to Jill, Jill Rumley. And this piece, I'm trying to get the glare off of it really struck me. I really think it captures the essence of Boulder, but more importantly, it's really well composed. The choice of colors work really well. And the imagery here, I'm, I'm not sure on the intention, but for me, if you can see close up, some of the people wearing masks, it absolutely captured what we're all going through right now. So it's a uh, you know, you've got the dark clouds with the sunbeams coming through, the rainbow leading you in, and then the, the masked figures. So I thought it was really quite clever while still managing to capture the quintessential boulder scene. So congratulations, it's a beautiful piece. Okay, let's see. Next, hopefully you can see that one. The Shooting Star Award goes to Sawhill Meadow, which <laughs> is uh, Lydia Potoff. Congratulations. Uh, this piece, really well done. Obviously, she's quite adept at drawing, but mostly it was the temperature, the capturing of accurate temperatures here that, that spoke to me. Her values are good, drawing is good, but that juxtaposition of cool and warm works really, really well here. And one other thing I loved about this piece, sorry, it's so high up, it's hard for me to zoom in, but hopefully you guys can see. It's a sort of layered color, broken color, which was often used by the Impressionists and she's used it to great effect here. So congratulations on that one. And then this one, Rod Forsland, beautiful, bold, boulder, gets the Shining Star Award. I thought this piece was really fantastic. It's a wonderful mix of representational and abstract, really well composed. The ram leads you in, really well drawn. That, that lamb, I'm always looking for several things, the basics, value, composition, edges, drawing skills, but then I look for a little bit more in a piece too. And this piece has a lot of things going for it. It's got some abstract touches that take it out of the ordinary. Beautiful grays he's got going on here that sort of suggest what's happening there in the background. And it's very difficult, I think, to pull off text in a painting without making it look heavy handed. And I think it works really well here, the pops of color he's chosen for the balloons and, well, I know that that boulder sign is, is well known, so, but he, he worked it well into this painting without it being, without it taking over. So really good job on this piece. 
And finally, best in show, this piece I kept going back to. First of all, before I announce the best in show, I just wanna give one more scan around and say this was not an easy choice. There were so many strong pieces in this show. Um, but there was one that I kept going back to over and over and over again. It just spoke to me so much. Okay, let's see. Getting turned around and dizzy now. But um, this piece right here, congratulations to Hannah Smith. This is Colorado Winter Eve. And this piece, like I said, I, I just kept coming back to over and over. And sometimes the most compelling pieces are not the most complex ones. This one is actually deceptively simple. It's got absolutely beautiful textures, but more it was the subtle grays that just kept pulling me and pulling me in. There is um, some actually quite intense chroma in here, but it's subtle and the way it's worked in, it really said Colorado to me, the Colorado winter. I mean, you've got to come see this piece in person if you haven't been already. It's truly extraordinary. And anyway, uh, congratulations, Hannah. This is, this is really an absolutely fabulous piece. So again, anyway, um, I wish you all well. Uh, stay safe, everybody. Take care. And uh, I hope to see you around Boulder.